Hey, we can finally do that other puzzle now, I think. Essence of that thing. The crankshaft. Letter from Edward. Next level. Ashes to ashes. A storm approaches, Augustus. A storm of metal and fire. That sounds dope. And souls along with it, young and vibrant. Yes, I have seen it coming. A worthy sacrifice, I am sure, and one that will allow the greater guardian that resides below to finish its channeling. Sacrifice of souls I make unto thee, great one. The gate shall be ready to be opened, and your freedom shall be at hand. So I wonder if it would be my can I can I move? Uh hello. Okay. Where nice the open door and death lurk, there is likely to be an ancient just beyond our senses, waiting. They prey on our misfortune and exploit it toward their own twisted ends. When hundreds of oil fields are set ablaze on the heels of war, the ancient's grip tightens, knowing that lives will be forfeit and resources squandered. But a few people make a difference. People like Michael Edwards, a Canadian industrial firefighter hired to put an end to the insanity at the end of the war. Canadian, eh? For him, the insanity was just beginning. Hey, casual. Hoping chapter 11 will be a bit more exciting. Seems to be already more exciting than chapter 10. Look at the graphics. Oh shit. I'm a nervous about this one. It feels more out of control than the others. More powerful. Sounds like the DARPA chief kind of. Probably not though. This is the way to blow out these things. You've done this enough to know that. It's by the numbers. It's all good. Just relax. That's the colonel, I think. Cloth and the water spray are there, so you're probably right. We've got 500 pounds of 80% nitroglycerin grade dynamite all in place. We're good to go. Edwards, you can pull your team back now. Get your team to a safe distance and we'll try to kill the fire. Sure thing. Coming back now. We're getting a pressure increase at the well cap. It's gonna tear itself apart. Hurry! Get your team out of the Holy shit. This feels like a different game. Infinitely more interesting than chapter 10. Hand is massive. What the hell happened? They're all dead. Oh shit. McCormick, Patterson, all gone. This is an interesting. Looks like they've been buried alive under tons of concrete. it well. Many have perished for it. Take it. Take it to the ruins of Engoth. At the ruins, a gathering of light. 
You want me to take this to some ruins under a house in Rhode Island? Take it. Save us. Oh. It is the tastiest of all the crab claws. Sensing the danger, Mike protects his hands. Using his coat to carefully pick up the artifact. I don't even have my coat. But whatever. Okay, hopefully our boy Mike finds the emerald one. Or I'm gonna be a little depressed. Looks like a pretty strong punch. What's up, blue dude? Do I have any weapons? I got an axe. That's pretty dope. You wanna target? Chop these Play Doh dudes. I'm predicting it's gonna be the like three attack finisher. No. Just one solid swing. That's all it takes. Anything else? Flashlight. That's pretty cool. We survival horror now. Only took like nine hours in game time. Not one of these things, huh? Out of here, scorpion. This one's pretty big. Just means it's a bigger target. You dancing around? Trying to like chop it up. Neither of us are doing a good job at what we're trying to do. It'd be nice if it locked on and I hit it. That would be beneficial. You're not gonna hit the head. like a badass so far. Chop you up? Maybe. Fuck it. No, run. What a hero. There's a lot of ladders in here. light puzzle then gotta find like one of those staffs in Indiana Jones stick it in the floor
Well, that's part of it. I'm gonna let that one live. He can tell his friends about Mike. Is that the one I came down? I don't think so. Nope. Another one of these guys. Oh, two of them. Well, you know what? Fuck that. Guess that's nothing? That's cool. Down the ladder we go. It doesn't seem like there's any penalty for not killing stuff. This kind of affects your sanity eventually. their pinatas. things if I can help it. No magic for you. Oh, shit. There's the uh the last one. But I don't have magic power. I gotta find that book and then come back down here. Gotta hook Mike up with the magics. At least we know we haven't missed it, because I was wondering back in the chapter with fake Indiana Jones, there was that hole in the wall that we could have used a trapper to get into, and we didn't, so I don't know what was in there. It seems like not the emerald effigy, though, so that's good news. Magic to combine these. Good. Straight out of Indiana Jones. Oh shit. Vandalism. It's like burning ants, except, you know, golden city statues. <laughs> Alright then. Seems a tad bit convoluted. Where was that hole in the floor? About to get the magics. Two, three, four. Yeah, the gang's all here now. Boy Luther. That dude. And Edward. No place for Mike, though. So maybe Mike's okay. Not gonna go down there yet. 